set, go. Hi, I'm Madeline. I'm Allison. And I'm Trey. And we are the, the Backyard Scientists. Today we'll be talking about density. Density is the amount of particles in an object. Density equals mass divided by volume. Mass is how much matter is in an object, usually measured by using a balance and is measured in grams. Volume is the, is the amount of area taken up by an object. Liquid volume is measured in a graduated cylinder, usually measured in milliliters. Objects can be more dense and less dense. More dense objects have more particles in a container. Less dense objects have less particles in the same size container. Let, let us demonstrate. When we are close, this table is our container. When we're closer together, we are more dense. When we are further apart, we are less dense. And that's by creating a seven-layer density column. Our materials include things from around the house. The seven things we will be measuring are lamp oil, vegetable oil, blue Dawn dish soap, light corn syrup, honey, water, and rubbing alcohol. We will be dyeing these liquids different colors. We will be dyeing these liquids different colors so we can see them better in the column. Just remember that the equation for density is mass divided by volume. Today we will be using a 16 ounce water bottle to put two ounces of each of our solutions which equals 60 milliliters. During our experiment, we'll measure the amount of mass that each solution is. Before we measure the mass of each solution, we need to figure out how much our graduated cylinder weighs. Our graduated cylinder that we are using weighs 40.1 grams. at the volume by looking at the meniscus. The meniscus is the bottom of the cur curve that's at the top of the liquid. measured out our volume, which is 60 milliliters. Now we must measure out our mass and then calculate our density. I will be measuring the liquid, which is water, and it equals 99.9. Now to find the exact mass of the liquid, you take the total liquid, not total mass of the liquid, 99.9, .9, and subtract the mass of the graduated cylinder which is 40.1 to get 59.8. Now to find the density, you divide the mass, 59.8, by 60, the volume, and you get 0.997, which is your density.
calculating the densities, we have put them in order from most dense to less dense. First, we put honey, light corn syrup, Dawn dish detergent, water, vegetable oil, rubbing alcohol, and lamp oil. These are our solutions. We're going to build our density column. Slow and steady.